Hey guys, it's Sydney. So today I have a September favorites video. And I know it's not even the end of September. I have no idea when I'm going to upload this, but right now it is a Saturday, September the 22nd. And, um, yeah, so, I don't know, I have no idea when this is going to get up. Probably going to edit and then upload later. So sorry, I haven't really been filming. Like, I have been filming, but not that much like I did in the summer because I don't have that much time anymore, yada yada yada. You guys have probably heard it from every other beauty guru. I try to pre-film some of my videos and then just schedule them to upload on, like, the middle of the week, so... You guys know what I mean? Because I have no idea how people like, I don't know how people do this, but they like film on like a Wednesday and then they upload, they, they edit, they do this in all in one day on the weekday, and on the weekday I have so much homework, I can't even like, and other ac activities that I have to do other than homework, um, so I have no idea how people do it, but I really envy them because they must have a lot of time on them. So this is a September favorites video and I'm so excited because I did a September favorites or I think I did one last year, so I'll link that below, but, um, well, actually, I don't know if I did. I probably didn't, but. Yeah, so, let's get started. Alright, so the first thing is this lotion, and it is the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Lotion. This is from last year, actually. I am too lazy to get myself another one, so I'm just kind of finishing this up, and once I finish it, I'll buy another one of the miniature size one, and this smells so good. It smells like fall, and I don't know, I just really like it, um, just... I mean, I guess you just have to smell it for yourself. It smells like a little bit of pumpkin, but then cinnamon and like leaves. Whoosh. Okay. So the next thing I have is another sweet cinnamon pumpkin product, and this is the hand sanitizer. I also have the warm apple cider, which is so good. It smells... These are so true to the name. Um, but this is the warm apple cider hand sanitizer, and this is also the creamy pumpkin hand sanitizer. I've just these have been getting me in the mood for fall. Happy first day of autumn or the fall time. Um, since today is the first day of fall, and I don't know, I just feel so like giddy, or I don't know if giddy is supposed to be like an appropriate thing to say. I don't know what that means, but I feel so like happy and just like that it's fall time. Whoa, God. okay, that didn't go well. So the next thing is a perfume, and I got this in Christmas last year, and this is the Justin Bieber perfume, and I feel like this perfume is perfect for any season. Um, I've just been using it a lot more. It smells like flowers, like smells like apples. Um, I think any person would love this if they love these type of like scents and stuff, but um, yeah, I know Justin Bieber came out with a new perfume. But I personally am not getting that perfume because I really want to get, I want I tried the DKNY Apple one, but I really didn't like it. Everyone else loves it, but I really hate it, the scent. So, I really recommend smelling the Justin Bieber, Justin Bieber perfume. So, yeah, and I shouldn't throw this on my bed because it's glass, I think. So, next for beauty favorites, I guess you can say, I just have a couple of products. So, the first one is the Revlon... Cream Luminance Eyeshadow, and I've been just using this as a base. I've been using the, oh gosh, I can't open this. Okay, I've been using the lightest color right here just as a base to just, lightest, it's really quick so I can just base it on my eyes, and then, I don't even know if that's a word, base it on my eyes, and then just add the um, Urban Decay Naked Palette Sin on my eyes, really lightly on top of that, so... I've been loving this and I have to join the bandwagon because honestly this is really amazing. Um, it's from the drugstore so it's pretty cheap and I really like it so. Whoosh. Okay. An e.l.f. product, I rarely like actually love e.l.f. products but I, I mean I still like them but it just depends on which product. So this one is the all-in-one cover color stick I think and this is in pink lemonade. Um, I've just been trying it out, I don't know why but Recently, I've been loving this. This is so much because it's only one dollar. I'm not sure if they still sell it, but it's only one dollar, and you can use this on your lips, your eyes. I don't know why you would use it on your eyes or your eyelids and your cheeks. So basically anywhere. But I've been loving this to put a really small amount on my lips and cheeks. Um, I don't know. It's very like I would just take it. It's very blendable too. So I would take it and then just like kind of just rub it in. I don't know if you guys can see that. 
This is the color before it's blended out. Sorry if you can't see Purplish that. Purplish pink color, but it blends very nicely on anyone's skin tone, so yeah, if you were wondering. Revlon, another Revlon product, and this is the Revlon, Revlon Super Lustrous Lip Gloss, and this is in Coral Reef. I know this isn't an even, this is like a spring, summer color, but um, really I've been loving this because I bought it a long time ago, but it's very creamy and it's very like, I really love the color overall. It just blends in really nicely and even though it's not a fall color, I love just putting this over my lips in the morning. It's very, very, very silky. Last beauty product is the Burt's Bees Lip Shimmer and this is in Guava. Um, I just, I don't know, I just put it on my lips really lightly and it just shimmers a little bit. It also has a minty little minty shimmer to it, um, or not minty shimmer, minty smell, fresh smell. World's best lip balm in sheer luminescent color. I do agree, but I feel like it gets dry very easily, so I would apply like something like moisturizing on. So my only product for skincare is this Ready Set Scrub Clean Start by Dermalogica Mini Size. Um, it's basically just an exfol- oh gosh, it's- it's basically, oh God, okay. it's basically just like an exfoliating scrub, not really scrub, I don't want to say scrub, it's very, I usually don't like scrubs, but this works really good. It's the Breakout Fighting Pore Refining Duo, and it's a mask and a scrub at the same time. I feel it's, it's very, it's not heavy, it's very light on your skin. Um, I will be doing a skincare routine with this product featured in it, so if you guys want a skincare routine and like this video and maybe like tell me if you really really want it really soon um, because I think I'm ready to do it because I've tried out the products for more than like three months I think or maybe I don't know I think I should wait a little longer but it might do. It's very, this smells like lemongrass, it smells like lemon limes, um, it's very refreshing so I like this product. Alright so now for non-beauty or fashion favorites. The first one I've been loving is this GoPro camera. I don't know if you guys have seen these before, but this is, um, if you guys saw my getting ready video, I'll link it below. I just recently filmed it. Um, I actually used this in it. This is the part, I use this for my sink parts where I would place this under the sink. And I, you guys were wondering how I got the camera to go under the sink, but it's, I didn't use my Canon camera really, like, I don't think I, I, would, I didn't use my Canon camera, the one I'm using now, um, to put under the sink, but it's actually my dad's, so it's not mine, just telling you guys. I just borrowed it, um, but I've really been loving it, because this GoPro camera, GoPros, they're basically known to, like, if you guys watch Devin Super Tramp, I think that's his username, um, videos, this is what, sometimes what he uses, you can go underwater with this, you can go, like in the snow with this. This is like the all-in-one like camera and it's pretty good quality, very good quality. You can use this in extreme weather, I guess. So yeah. For my bag of the month, I guess you can say. My bag of the month, I've been loving, or sorry, I keep on saying I've been loving, but I've been using this long shop egg, Lee Plea egg bag. I got this for my birthday um last year. November, so this is, I don't know, and it's, I don't know, I've been using this a lot more often, I don't know why, but it's just navy blue, it's a navy blue plea egg, this is the smallest size, and it does, it's very spacious, and it is really good quality, also, um, it cannot break, I, pretty, the material is very, it's like, it feels waterproof in a way, but, um, it's a very big bag also, so it can carry a lot of things inside of it, and I really like it. So if you carry a lot of things in your bag and you kind of want a simple bag, I really recommend this Lee Egg bag by Longchamp. Um, and this is like my only designer bag. I, it's not really designer, but it's only like good, really good quality bag. I feel this is like the perfect bag for me, so I'm very happy with it. The last favorite is on my iPad. And Oh, I have to do homework after this. I hate homework. I'm going to try to finish it all today so I don't procrastinate it all tomorrow. Um, so my favorite thing on here has been Pink Pad. And I figured out Pink Pad by Sweet Beauty X in her favorites video a while ago. 
and ThinkPad is an app, I think you can get it on the iPhone too, or iPhone also, but not the iPhone 2, but the iPhone. You can get it on any iPhone, but basically, it's just a period, like, I don't know, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure you guys are all girls here, so, um, it just tracks your period and when you're gonna get it, um, yeah, it just, you enter your information in, like when you got it, it looks like this. I actually, you make your own profile and everything, it's so like cute. But you make it and then you in enter your information, um, and then it kind of calculates like when you're, it's estimating when you're going to get your next one, you know, tracking the days down and I find it so helpful. This is one of the most helpful apps I've ever used for like fertile days, whatever that means. Really, really do recommend it for you guys. Um, and plus, if a guy's looking for your phone, through your phone or whatever, no one's gonna really, like, know, oh, it's just pink pad, it doesn't really sound weird, I guess. It just, I don't know. I don't know, guys. And I've been loving Siri on my iPad, so let's ask Siri a question. Okay, let's, let's try it again. Siri. Hola. Yes? Are you married or single? No comment. Is there a special guy in your life? Checking on that. Would you like me to search the web for Azera's? Okay, Siri doesn't really work, okay? I mean, Siri, I never really come to use Siri, but... Alright, peace out, girl. Thanks for subscribing. Bye, guys.